Hey guys, so in this problem, we are going to solve another random board exam problem. This is problem number 13. So in this problem, we have two triangles have equal bases. The altitude of one triangle is 3 units more than its base. And the altitude of other triangle is 3 units less than its base. So find the altitudes if the areas of the triangles differ by 21 square units. So in this problem, given tayo guys, of course, this is board examination. So we have... Uh, choices. So for letter A, we have 6 and 12. For B, you have 3 and 9. For C, you have 5 and 11. And for D, you have 4 and 10. So we are required to get or to compute for the altitudes of these two triangles. So let's first illustrate those triangles, including its uh, dimensions. So, the altitude of one triangle is 3 units more than its base. So, basically, the height. Okay, the height, let's say ito. This is. So, the height of this smaller triangle, let's say H1. And the height of this uh, bigger triangle, we have here H2. So, from the problem, we have here, so stated sa problem, the altitude of one triangle is 3 units more than its base so basically it is the bigger triangle so h2 is three units more than its base so that is b more than so plus we have here three so three units more than its base and we have here the altitude of other triangle is three units less than its base so that is h1 equals three units less than so that is b minus Three. Okay, so we have these equations here. So uh, we have here two equations, three unknown. So we need another equation to get okay, the altitudes. So we have here, binigyan tayo ng other condition. If the areas of the triangles differ by 21 square units. So if the area of the bigger triangle is A sub 2. And for the smaller, we have here A sub 1. So the difference between their areas is 21 square units so a sub 2 minus a sub 1 is equal to 21 so we have these three equations to solve the altitudes so let's just perform algebra to get this uh, H1 and H2. So, yung required natin dito guys is the height or the altitude of these triangles. So, you have here from equation 1, H1 equals B minus 3. And from equation 2, we have H2 equals B plus 3. And from equation 3, we have A sub 2 minus A sub 1 equals 21. So, from our geometry, so as you recall, the area of a triangle is just one half times its base times the height. Okay, so therefore, A1 can be expressed as one half, okay, base. Okay, from A1 here, we have here one half base times its height, H1. And for A2, we have 1 half its base times H2. So let's just substitute that values here. So we have here from equation 3. So we have 1 half base H2 minus for A1, we have here 1 half base H1 equals 21. So for us to eliminate this fraction 1 half here, so, we need to multiply 2 to both sides of the equation. So, this becomes, okay, multiply tayo ng 2, both sides, so that wala tayong fraction sa left side. So we have here B, H2, okay, cancel na yun, 1 half times 2, 1. We have here B, H1, equals, we have here 2 times 21. So, that is 42. Okay, so you have this equation, then balikan natin yung first 
two equations. So H1, okay, from equation 1, H1 is B minus 3. And we have here H2 as B plus 3. So let's just substitute this H1 here. Okay, substitute natin siya. And H2 in this equation. So, hanapin natin si B. Then, after getting B, finally, we can get H1 and H2. Since H1 and H2 are both expressed in terms of B. So, substituting, we have here B times, so H2, that is B plus 3. Okay, minus, so B here, so times B yan. So, B times H1. So, H1 is B minus 3. So, that is equals to 42. Okay. So, multiply natin dito. So, i-distribute natin. So, B squared plus 3B. So, minus we have here B squared parenthesis. Don't forget that. So, we have here B squared. So, minus. So, we have B times negative 3. So, that is negative 3B. So, equals 42. So, simplify lang natin, no guys, b squared plus 3b minus, okay, distribute natin yung negative sign doon sa loob ng parenthesis. So, minus b squared, so negative times negative, that is positive. So, this is plus 3b. And that is equal to 42. So, simplify natin. So, this is... Uh, b squared minus b squared. So, basically, this will cancel out. So, 0 na yun. So, 3b plus 3b, that is 6b. And we have here equals 42. Okay. So, divide natin 6 both sides. So, b equals 42 divided by 6. So, the bases of the triangles are, so we have here 42 divided by 6. So, this is 7. Since we got the dimension for the base, so that is 7 units, balikan natin sa equation 1 and 2 to get the required in the problem, which are the altitudes. So we have here H1 equals B. Ang B natin, as we have solved, we have here 7, so that is minus 3. So we have here H1 as 7 minus 3, that is 4. So we have H1 as 4 units. So, for H2, that is 7. So, 7 yung B. As we have solved, 7 plus 3. So, therefore, H2 equals, we have here, 10. So, therefore, the altitudes of the triangles are 4 and 10 respectively. Okay. So, these are the answers for this past board exam problem. So, sa board exam, letter D yung answer nitong problem. That's it guys. Thank you for watching this video.